it's crazy how the deep state is packed with such shallow people. You know, how is it? How is it the deep state is packed with such shallow people? It must make, it's got to take a lot of those shallow people to fill up the deep state, you know? And there's, there's a lot of deep state conspiracies about the Democratic Party. However, if there's one thing we can say about Kamala Harris's rhetoric, it's not deep, okay? It's, it's not deep. Not deep, not deep doesn't mean not dangerous, but it's certainly, it's certainly not deep, okay? Maybe instead of worrying about the deep state, we need to be more worried about like super, super, super shallow state. A super shallow state might be more of the, that's the conspiracy we should be talking about. You know, when asked about Kamala Harris's off-putting laugh for campaign her campaign responded our strategy is based on the theory the squeaky wheel gets the grease and apparently the squeaky chipmunk gets put down poor peanut the lesson here is if if you're gonna be squeaky make sure that you're either a wheel or a politician not not a squirrel or a raccoon okay that's the squeaky rule and i you know what? I told a stupid joke and my producer, Phil, is telling me with disgust, why don't you act your age? Why don't you act your age? Can you believe that? That son of a... Phil wants me to die. What a jerk. What is this? It's, it's like Kamala Harris campaign talking to Joe Biden. Act your age, Joe. That's not nice. It's not a nice thing to... Anyways, the news keeps talking about this political capital. You know, isn't the political capital in Washington, Washington, D.C.? I mean, I, I feel like everybody already knows where the political capital is. You need to stop telling, stop telling us like we're stupid about political capital. We already know that. You know, the Harris campaign is touting their high national security. They have high national security policies. But isn't it strange how she never goes on record about which nations she's securing. You know, by national security, we mean us. We mean this nation, dang it. We want to we wanna be the ones that are secure. <laughs> you know, Kamala Harris has been criticized for her massive flip-flops. She's got massive flip-flops. But I, but I think this is actually the mainstream of sewage media just covering for her because her usual performance is more of a flop flop you know flip flop would be a vast overstatement that would be a vast improvement you know Ka kamala harris wants to mandate wants a mandate from the people kamala harris wants a political mandate from the people and a, and a mandate is going to be quite difficult considering she hates men you see what i did there she can't you can't you can't have a you can't get a mandate you can't have a mandate without a man in it and they clearly hate, they hate men. <laughs> all right, that's all I got. Those are my last political jokes. That doesn't mean I'm not going to keep doing political jokes later because I'm kind of in the, that's kind of like I've been doing that for a while, so I might have more. But that's all I've, that's basically all I've got here. The wad has been shot.